ओके सो उदय इज आज दैट वॉट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन साइलेंट लंग एंड स्पेजम ओके सो मैनी ऑफ यू हु नो द आंसर दिस मे साउंड अ वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन बट आई थिंक इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर ऑल दोज हु आर स्टार्टेड वर्किंग इन इंटेंसिव केयर और इमरजेंसी मेडिसिन और इन द इंटर्नशिप दिस इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन सो अंडरस्टैंड दैन इन अस्थमा एंड सी ओ पी डी वॉट एपन्स देर इज अ ब्रॉन्को कंस्ट्रिक्शन ऑफ द एयरवे और ब्रॉन्को स्पाजम ऑफ द एयरवे the airway gets narrow and because of this the air flow which is laminar in the airway becomes turbulent and therefore you when you auscultate the chest you may hear the wheeze or ronchi and if the bronchoconstriction or bronchospasm is very severe you may hear the wheeze or ronchi audibly also when you go near the patient you may hear them uh, by your naked uh, ears also but because behind the uh, bronchoconstriction becomes very severe and the patient started getting fatigue and now that what happens there is no flow of air between the airway and therefore when you auscultate the chest it becomes a silent chest nothing is heard so silent chest is a very bad sign it means that there is a severe bronchoconstriction and the patient's efforts are falling and the patient may require intubation very early it's an impending arrest sort of condition so this is very very important i hope this clarifies and do read it more about it thank you